Hello, this is Senior Vitality Program and I am Kate from Community Tech Network. Today's lesson is going to be about the Weather Channel app, the app where you can check out the weather in your location. The Weather app is not installed by Apple um, on your iPad, so you will have to get it from App Store. And the app we recommend is called the Weather Channel app. There are many other applications um, you can choose on your own. I just will focus on one on the Weather Channel. So I will go to App Store uh, in the search. In the search bar, I just type weather and right here, it says the weather channel for iPad. So I would just tap on it. Here, how it should look like. You can see how many reviews it has. And if you don't have it, you will have right here, you will have get button or little cloud uh, button. So you will have to tap on that to get it. Uh, in my case, it's already there. I already installed it. So it says open. Let me show you how it looks like on the home screen. Here it is, the weather channel. To open it, I just simply tap and it automatically shows me my location. But when you open it for the first time, you will have to either allow access to your location or uh, right here in the search, you can see that here's a little magnifying glass. And if you tap on it, it says add city or zip code. So you would just add the zip code. Let's say it's, I want San Francisco. Um, I can just type 94102 or you can type your zip code. And right here, uh, it shows me San Francisco. I just tap on it. And it shows me the weather there. The weather right now. This box is for uh, projection uh, for today. I can see the weather in the afternoon, overnight, or I can tap on hourly and get hourly projection. Or daily, if I want to check out weather on Sunday, I can just um, scroll and see what's, what's there. Right here, you can see the details, the wind, humidity, pressure, etc. Uh, you can see daily forecast right here as well. Hurricane uh, tracker, etc. Okay. Um, right here, you can see health and activities, and um, here's flu. And here's extended 15 day flu forecast. So they can show you that as well. Outdoor con condition, air quality, etc. Um, down here, uh, you can see this um, advertisements. This is uh, something that's going to be, uh, you know, showing different things constantly because it's free application. So they have to make money on something. So they do it on advertisement. Just don't pay attention to it. Uh, don't tap on it. Just use it for the app. Right here, it says go premium. And this is um, gives us opportunity to pay and don't get all that additional uh, stuff. But, you know, it's just for checking the weather. It's not necessarily to go premium. Right here, you can also see different tabs. It just shows you different um, uh, screens, like hourly projection, and you will get screen with hourly projection, daily, radar, um, top stories from the news, etc. The main page is right here, and you can get all of this stuff on one page. It's just a little bit smaller. Right here, you can have settings and um, you can change units. If you understand uh, better in Celsius, you can uh, just tap right here and go to metric or go to hybrid system. 
I understand in um, Fahrenheit in the imperial system, so I would tap on it. And um, you can double check privacy policy, terms of use, etc. right here. If you want to change the location, you just tap on the search right here and add it. Right now it says recent um, San Francisco, but if I want to add something, let's say Concord, um, I just enter the zip code and then tap on Concord. And it takes a couple of seconds to change and I can see the weather in Concord. And if I want to go back to San Francisco, again, I tap on um, magnifying glass, but I can see San Francisco in recent. So I don't have to, you know, type the zip code or anything. Um, so tap on San Francisco and get all the information there. I hope um, it, it's pretty simple. So to get the weather um, on your iPad, you can download from App Store the weather channel. To add your location, you will either, like when you um, download it and open for the first time, it asks you for um, access. And if you allow the access to your location, um, it will be automatically shown right here. But if you don't allow it um, or didn't get that um, notification, uh, you just go to search bar right here and type the zip code where you live and it will be added. Uh, if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. Please subscribe to our channel. Uh, stay well and healthy. Have a great day. And this was Kay for Senior Vitality Program. See you in the next video.